Okay guys, um, I'm here. I'm just going to do a quick tutorial of PowerTab Editor. It's a free program. You can go look it up on download.com or CNET, wherever you want to go look. Like I said, it's going to be a very basic tutorial, just a couple minutes long. Um, I'm just going to be doing the first section of Smoke on the Water to give you the basic idea of how to use this program. It's rather simple. Now go to the two middle strings on this bar right here and in the first two notes put a zero and the second one or the third one from the bottom rather put a zero and the fourth one from the bottom put a zero you can see that now I'll do the same on the next strings except put threes and do the same on the next one except put fives okay now skip this middle space it's just more organized it's, you can use it if you want but just looks better and on this next one put two zeros put two threes this time I actually put a six two sixes and then two fives it's a four okay two fives okay now right now this is what it sounds like obviously it's not right so what you have to do is you have to go down to this bar down here and fix it what you do is just click on one of the zeros go down to the bottom here and change it to a quarter note if you don't know what a quarter note is it's basically a lowercase d with the bottom filled in so there's no hole in the d okay click on that do the same for the three and now do the same for the five except after you do that for the five after you add it to the quarter note go over a couple you'll see a quarter note with a little dot after it click that too now go over to this zero oh here let me show you what it sounds like now audio is messing up here we go sorry about that You can see it's still not right, but the first part is right. Okay, now if you go over to the next pair of zeros, make the first zero a quarter note, the second, or the pair of threes a quarter note. The sixes you should actually leave is the eighth note that it's on. It should already be on an eighth note. And then go over to the five change that to a quarter note and also add the dot onto that so now if you know the song you'll know this will sound right it'll all come together you can see it sounded right I'm not gonna add another one because I don't want to waste your time but that is the basic gist on how to use some of the minor functions of power tab um, if you have any questions or you want me to do something in PowerTab that you don't know how to do or you can't find somewhere else, leave me a comment and please rate. Thank you.